Hey you, what you doing? Not much, huh? You didn't go anywhere today? Oh, just, you know, wondering, that's all. What do I know? About what? I know nothing. What on earth do you mean? And should I know something? <laughs> I heard you sneaking back in with some bags. I thought I'd let you think you got it past me, just for a little while. I was just finishing up some work on the PC, and you look so cute trying to sneak about. Yes, it was very cute, and I didn't have the heart to disturb you. So, what have you been up to then? It's still a secret. Come on, tell me. Ah, oh, fine. I can wait a little bit longer, but just a little bit. What have I been doing? Hmm, nothing fun. Just grabbed a few things from the shops for our movie night tonight. Which, we still haven't decided on any movies yet. Come on, there's so many to choose from. True, maybe too many. There are some good horror movies and... Tons of bad ones. <laughs> oh, but first, I have something to show you. Come, follow me. I thought it would be nice to fall asleep watching movies and being, you know, just generally lazy people. And yes, your favourite pillow is right here. Uh-huh, I brought out two duvets. Why? Of course we're sharing, silly. Just you wait and see how I turn it into a nest. Did you think it was going to be one each? You big cutie. Like there could be a duvet in this world that I wouldn't share with you. Hmm. Well, there isn't. It simply doesn't exist. Your turn for what? Are you finally revealing what all the not so sneaky sneakiness was about? <laughs> no, I'm not getting cheeky. I'm actually a little excited. Uh huh. Yep. And you? Oh, you could be a spy. Not for long, but. <laughs> no, come on. Show me. Hmm, it's in the kitchen. What's all this? No way you got pumpkins. <laughs> They're for carving, right? And eating. <laughs> yes, of course I want to. I've wanted to for years. I just never really got round to it because my family was never into Halloween. Hmm, well, we would watch horror movies, but that was because they were already playing and we'd keep candy for any trick-or-treaters. But yeah, they weren't that big on it. Oh, I always wanted to, believe me, but it's not the same when you're the only person excited about it. I guess it's a little sad, but it became a habit after a while. There would be the odd year where I'd go out and buy a pumpkin, but the poor thing would be so lonely all by itself. <laughs> True, it would have me for company. Mm. Mm, thank you. I love this so much. Mm. I honestly love Halloween. There's something so magical about it. Don't you think? But the next day always makes me feel a little sad. Like it's over too soon. Oh, you won't let it be? And how are you going to do that? Do you secretly have a time machine? Where to next, Doctor? <laughs> hmm. 
Not flipping the calendar to the next month is a step in the right direction, but please continue. Oh, we're taking out November the 1st completely, so that it'll remain October 31st. Yes, and the movie marathon could continue. I can definitely get on board with that. Huh, a 48 hour long day. I like it. Well, I feel sorry for anyone celebrating their birthday on the 1st of November, but I don't know anyone who does, so they're safe from us. <laughs> Oh, you know someone whose birthday falls on that day? Actually, they should be happy, if anything. Yeah, they don't age anymore. We've practically upgraded them into an immortal. <laughs> oh, it doesn't work like that, huh? Well, only time will tell. <laughs> okay, enough of that. It's pumpkin time. Oh nice, you got the ingredients for pumpkin pie. Have you ever made it before? Well, we're making it together this year, so it'll be perfect. Mm. Whether it likes it or not. Okay, so pumpkin for you, and a pumpkin for me, and oh, that's so cute. A tiny little baby pumpkin. I can't carve that, that's adorable. But I do kinda wanna carve a cute little smile and eyes on it too. You might feel left out. After all, they are a family. Exactly. It would be cruel not to. Well, you've got everything ready. Is this the dish for the pumpkin guts? <laughs> Did you find the serving spoons for scooping? Yes, perfect. <laughs> no way. You got out the melon baller? Is that for the baby pumpkin? Were you intending to murder it? I mean, carve it, even if I didn't want to? <sighs> okay, glad to hear it. But yeah, we're scooping everything out. <laughs> mm, thought of any movies yet? Me? Well, there is one that I really want to watch. It's one of my classic favourites from my childhood. I have no idea how my parents let me watch it, but hey-ho. <laughs> Can you guess? If I give you any clues, you'll guess it straight away. Well, yeah, that kind of is the point of clues, but I'm too generous with my clue giving. Okay, um, a toy doll. Damn, that was a little too obvious. It was either going to be Chucky or Annabelle. Unless there are more killer doll movies I don't know about. I wouldn't be surprised. And it's a genre I don't particularly care for either. No, not because I'm scared of it. I just find them so funny. There's nothing even remotely scary about them. I can't remember which Annabelle movie it was. I'd gone to the cinema to watch with friends and there's this one scene where the girl's on the top of the bunk bed and she looks down the wall side at the lower bunk and Annabelle is staring straight up at her and I just burst out laughing. Oh, the moment was pure gold. No, no one else laughed. <laughs> but yeah, at least Chucky embraces the funny. Well, we have to watch Child's Play for nostalgia's sake. Perfect. <sighs> You're going to make me watch all the Annabelle movies now, aren't you? Maybe, maybe not. Well, I vote not, please. <laughs> oh. Oh, I have a better one that you can't say no to. Mm-hmm. Yes, I do. Constantine. I know, we watch it every now and then anyway, but you have to admit, it's a perfect Halloween movie. Yeah. I forget how unsettling it can be. That first exorcism gives me the creeps. 
it's by far the creepiest part of the movie for me. Um, I'm not too fussed about the rest of it, but that is like a shock to the system. <laughs> I can't wait now. I'll settle down with some snacks to watch movies. Hmm. I don't know what you're planning, but you better behave. Now that we have a 48 hour long Halloween, I ought to be more careful. <laughs> you're right, we have all of tomorrow for movies too. But what's so special about midnight? Uh huh. So the veil is at its thinnest. Okay, Dresden. You wanna do what? No, I'm not doing the Ouija board. Nope, 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 nope. Hey, I will take my pumpkin and baby Mr. Pumpkin and lock us all in the bedroom. No, I don't trust your pumpkin. <laughs> it's most likely in on it with you. Baby, I don't want to do that. Come on, promise me you won't. You mean it? Okay, I believe you. <laughs> ah, let's finish these pumpkins and they can sit and watch movies with us. And we can feed them pumpkin pie once it's done. <laughs> okay, that's a teeny tiny bit evil. Baby, are you seriously going to make me watch all of them? Now that is evil.